this pair of stranded boaters who are safe tonight, thankfully, thanks to FWC and especially a sharp-eyed boat captain from Citrus County who just happened to be nearby, spotting people among some islands about 40 miles offshore. As Fox 13's Haley Hines reports, they'd been out there for more than a day, dehydrated, hungry, and far from home. Captain Billy Henderson hit the water Wednesday morning north of Chassahowitzka Bay. Me and a couple buddies just out trout fishing, running around, kind of scouting. His catch of the day wouldn't involve a line or a net. Decided to run up a set of islands that we'd never typically run and saw a person flagging us down. It was a woman in distress, exhausted, shaking and dehydrated. It turns out she'd been laying there for like three hours. Just, just waiting for somebody to come by. She wasn't a lone castaway. She was with a man farther back where his 30-foot dock barge had gotten stuck in shallow marshy water. The Coast Guard, FWC, Pasco Sheriff's Office, and Army Air Crew responded. Henderson helped reach the man with his micro-draft skiff. He's jumping for joy then, but he was in really bad shape. His hands were all cut up from the oysters because, I guess, for two days they've been wandering around out there in the marsh trying to find help. Turns out the Coast Guard had been looking for the man reported missing from Hudson. It's unclear what happened to the barge before it ran out of fuel. With this week's fog, it wasn't easy to spot. They drank two Gatorades and two waters each, and then the girl asked for something to eat, and we had some, some deer sausage that we make on the boat. FWC took over from there. Captain Henderson can't help but wonder what if he'd chosen a different route. Look, I mean, we just total luck. It was a fishing trip turned rescue mission. It's the lonely place out there, not on the ocean. And um, if the wind's blowing the wrong way and you got no way to stop yourself, it ain't a bad trip to Mexico from here with an east wind blowing. For some reason, we happen to be there at that spot. In Crystal River, Haley Hines, Fox 13 News.